Hey y'all, so in today's video I will be showing you guys how to do the braided butterfly that y'all have been seeing trending. So here's what you'll need. You'll need needle and thread, some super glue, you'll need scissors, and of course the hair that you're going to be braiding with to make your butterfly. So I want the color, the blonde, to be on the inside, so I'm going to start off with the blonde first. I'm going to hold the piece of hair in my mouth and then begin to braid all the way down. You don't have to braid all the way down, but braid down long enough to create the butterfly. This blonde is gonna be for the inside. So now that I'm finished with the blonde for the inside, I am now gonna to go to the brown braid that I will be using as the outline. Now that I've braided both of them, I will now begin to start to form the butterfly with the blonde. So this is going to be the inside of the butterfly. I'm not a good explainer, y'all. I'm more of a visual person. So if y'all can just look and see what I'm doing, because like, I don't know how to explain this, but yeah, I'm just folding it. And it, the glue dried really, really fast too. So I'm just folding it like that. And then I'm going to fold it like this. Yeah, I don't know. Maybe I should just hush on this part and y'all just watch. I don't know. Yeah, I'm going to just shut up. So boom, once I created the inside, y'all, I am going to cut the excess because, again, this is the inside of the butterfly, so I'm going to cut the the rest of the pieces that's just laying, hanging there. Ugh, I'm so horrible at this. So yeah, y'all, y'all picking up what I'm putting down, so I'm just going to cut that. And this is the inside piece. This is the blonde that you're going to see inside of the butterfly, so yeah. 
and I went back and put some more glue too, just in case so it won't um, unfold. Now this part is just you're gonna take the black braid and just trace the outside, trace the outline, just outline the blonde braid with the black or brown, whatever other color you use. It's so many other ways that y'all can trace it or outline it with the other one. I probably just did it like a quick and thrown together way, but I'm sure it's another way to do it. This is just the way that I achieve mine, y'all. So, yeah. <music> like it looks like some are everywhere but then you're going to take the two pieces that's hanging and wrap it in the front whatever wh whatever side that you want to be your front you're going to wrap the two up and then super glue it and once i super glued it i'm now going to add super glue to the like two pieces of the braid just to seal it and make sure that that doesn't unravel as well <music> And while it was still like not dry yet, I took my fingers and rubbed it together so that it was completely sealed. Again, it's other ways that you could seal it. I've also seen some people leave it unbraided, like probably put like spritz or something on it. But it's different ways you guys can do it. I'm just showing y'all the way that I did it. And this is the way I achieved it. Now I'm finna sew it on. And I don't know what made me think I was finna put it that high because I didn't want it that high. So y'all finna see me fix that real quick. Mm-mm. Mm -mm. There you go. So really, y'all, that's basically it. Um, I hope this was helpful y'all. I'm more so on the visual side. I have to see it. You can't talk me through it. None of that. So I hope I did a good job y'all with explaining it. If not, I know I did a good job with showing it. So yeah, y'all make sure y'all like, comment, and subscribe and don't go paying for this tutorial because I've been seeing people charging people for this tutorial when I just gave it to y'all for free. I literally just gave this to y'all for free. So yeah, thank me later.
did my butterfly smile y'all because i already got a lot going on in my head right now i got curls going on and all of that but yes i actually like the small i should have did them a little bigger but yeah bye